The owner of ramen restaurant Yume wo Katare is lively today as he speaks to a longer line than usual outside of his restaurant. There's a lot to be excited about at the popular Somerville Eatery as it celebrates its four-year anniversary. Uh, I've been coming here for the last couple of years and it's been, uh, it's been an experience every time. So, you know, it's, it's great to, to celebrate that with that one. Yume wo Katare is not like your typical ramen restaurant. While the crowd raves about the food, the restaurant also creates an atmosphere for customers to share their dreams for the future. You know, there's a ton of ramen shops in Massachusetts. It's a very popular dish. Um, but as you can see on our window, this is not a ramen shop. Um, we want to create an atmosphere where people can feel comfortable and feel safe sharing their dreams and dreaming really big dreams. That spirit is what keeps customers coming back. It's, it's great to be in an environment where it's so positive, you know, especially with the way things are. I know that sounds very lofty, but um, it's just refreshing to come here and just have everybody talk about their dreams and, and get asked the questions, how do you want to get there? It's strange to go to a restaurant that wants you to believe in yourself and finish the entire bowl of food. 50,074 dreams have been shared with Yuma Wilkatare so far. Denny Wright, who was first in line today, shared one more with the restaurant. Hi, I'm Denny. Hey, hey. And, um, I got two dreams. I'm a teacher, and it is my dream to create a classroom where my students will want to share their dreams and will want to embrace themselves like we do here. Nice. Hey. All right, and today, Denny got a blow. For BU News Service, I'm Zoe Mitchell.